Greetings, hello, hello, welcome. Welcome to those of you who know me, those of you who don't know me. This is new to me, so um, for this time, I ask that you bear with me if any weird technical things happen. Um, please feel free to give me feedback after the session so that I may improve if need be for the next time. I so appreciate it. But in the meantime, let's immediately go into presence. Mm, and I ask that for this half hour, you simply allow yourself to feel whatever it is you're feeling, experience whatever it is you're experiencing, and to suspend any judgments or any blocks. Just open, allow yourself to open to what presents. I will be using music. I may be using some tuning forks. I'm simply going to go with the flow and see what arises. Um, I want to start this with a tuning fork just to ground us, first of all, get us in our bodies. Mm, I'm just breathing you all in. Feeling good already. Welcome. Just settle in. Deepen into your body. Let yourself connect to your body. Connect to your breath. Allow your ribs to expand so that we're deep, breathing deeply. Oh, let that air go to the tips of your toes. Breathe that in. Allow yourself to settle in. A lot to experience these days. A lot to breathe in and breathe out. We're all doing wonderfully. In whatever ways we're called to help. In whatever ways we're called to witness. In maybe whatever ways we're called to rest and simply be. We all have differing experiences and all of them are valid. So let's take this time right now to honor all that we are, all that we are becoming, and all that we are connecting to. Welcome, welcome. I'm going to do some deep breathing. Do you feel called to close your eyes? Please go ahead and do that. I like to keep my eyes open so that I may drink you all in and so that I may share what's coming through. This is a time for just allowing, witnessing, acknowledging, and honoring. Maybe you're feeling calm and peaceful during this time, having the opportunity to unplug, to unplug from work, to unplug from certain situations, anything that maybe became a habit. What a wonderful opportunity to allow that to drop, to have a respite, to just breathing in.
checking in, checking in your body. Is there anything that's presenting? Anything that wants to speak to you? Anything that just wants some attention? Maybe there's nothing. That's okay too. Just enjoy this. Savor this experience. This experience of being in you and you and your body. Truly you. take a moment. I'm feeling led to read a passage from a book called The Untethered Soul. As I read this, continue to feel it in you. Breathe out. Allow yourself this time in the presence of your body, the soul. Sometimes you will notice that it feels hot inside as pain passes. In fact, as you relax into the energy of the pain or the energy of anything for that matter, you may feel tremendous heat in your heart. That is the pain being purified from your heart. Learn to enjoy that burning it is called the fire of yoga. It may not seem enjoyable, but you will learn to enjoy it because it is freeing you. Kind of like this time is freeing all of us from old habits, old paradigms, old structures. In truth, pain is the price of freedom. At the moment you are willing to pay that price, you will no longer be afraid. The moment you are not afraid of the pain, you will be able to face all of life's situations without fear. Sometimes you will go through deep experiences that bring up intense pain inside of you. If it is in there, it is going to come up. If you have any wisdom, you will leave it alone and not trying to change your life to avoid it. You will just relax and give it the space it needs to release and burn through you. You do not want this stuff inside your heart. To feel great love and freedom, to find the presence of God within you, all of this stored pain must go. It is in this inner work that spirituality becomes reality. Oh, let's breathe that one in. If any of you are just joining, welcome. Welcome. I'm reading a passage from The Untethered Soul by Michael Singer. Spiritual growth exists in that moment when you are consciously willing to pay the price of freedom. You must be willing at all times, in all circumstances, to remain conscious in the face of pain and to work with your heart by relaxing and remaining open. What if you remained open through anything that presented? Any fear? love, any light, 
any tension, any anxiety. Simply relaxing and remaining open. Remember, if you close around something, you will be psychologically sensitive about that subject for the rest of your life because you stored it inside of you. You will be afraid that it will happen again. But if you relax, instead of closing, it will work its way through you. If you can stay open, the blocked energy inside of you will release naturally. And you will not take on any more. This is the core of spiritual life. Welcome. Welcome. When you are comfortable with pain passing through you, you will be free. This world will never be able to bother you again because the worst the world can do is to hit the pain stored within you. If you do not care, if you are no longer afraid of yourself, you are free. What if we befriended everything inside of us? Everything that arose, everything we felt. What an amazing opportunity right now that we have to savor, be present to ourselves, to be present to others and befriend each other, befriend our hearts, befriend ourselves. I see you. Thank you. Thank you for joining me. Let's take another deep breath. How's your body feeling? Any tightness? Simply be aware. If there is tightness, where is it? Perhaps you feel drawn to put your hand on it. Give it some attention. Ask if it has anything to tell you. For everything presenting, it honors you. share with me after this video is over, after you've had a chance to listen to it. Share with me how you felt, how you're feeling. Here we go. May we remain open to all that is presenting in this time. May we dispel anything that is moving through us, for it is not just ours, it is the collective. We're light workers. We're anchoring this energy. We're allowing it to pass through us and anchoring a new light. It's okay to feel uncomfortable, you might. It's okay to feel blissful and brilliant. We're all experiencing this in different ways. Every experience is valid, true. to the law. 
love you are. May you awaken to the love within you. May your body calibrate further to this vibration that is already open. May it recalibrate to this vibration if it is open. We are always expanding, always bringing in new and deeper energies. Now more than ever, the earth is feeling through us a still point that has been created. What an opportunity to feel Mother Earth, to feel the energy from the heavens. Enjoy it. May we allow it to wash through us. May we allow it to wash through our relationships. To wash through all we connect with, all we feel connected to. This is no accident. I see you. If you've been feeling overwhelmed, if you've been feeling fearful, anxious, I understand. May we open our hearts to that, simply allow it and honor it. For it needs to be anchored as well. And you are doing a wonderful, wonderful job with it. You are feeling exactly what you are equipped to transmute to release and dissolve. And your body, your energetic field, was made perfectly to bring in the love, the light, the bliss that is channeling through all of us right now. So whether you're experiencing it on one flip side of the coin, through fear, anxiety, uncomfortable feelings, thank you for doing the healing work, the transmuting work, so that for those of us who are experiencing the bliss, the calm, the stillness, the still point, the expansion, the awakening, anchoring, the flip side of the coin so that we may experience and work with that. We are all working together so beautifully so. So beautifully so. I'm going to anchor some mother energy, mother earth energy at the moment, feeling led to that. your body again.
to be called anchor celebrated and honored. Simply allow yourself the gift of presence. Breathing in. Breathing out. I don't know about you all, but man, am I feeling a surge of energy just up through my feet, up through my central channel. delicious. How does it feel for you? May we awaken. May we awaken to all we are. All we have the capacity to be. And all we share with all of those around us. Indirectly or directly. All beacons of light, each of us. Whether we are clearing that beacon presently, emptying that beacon so that more light may come in, honoring pain, honoring fear, honor the honoring and befriending whatever it is that is visiting us at the moment. It is all valid. came to experience, to experience it all. What an opportunity to experience deeply right now. All of it at the same time. How many of you are feeling as though it's surreal in this time? As though we may be living in paradox. Thank you for sharing this time with me. Continuing to be here, I see you. I feel the love and light. And I call in any further awakening at this time. I call in any light codes that are ready to be switched on. I call in. All the light, love, and honor. I call in through our ancestors, through any divine sources we want to call in at this time for support, for help, for amplification, for grounding, for everything we are. We ask for help from above help from Mother Earth as we extend it, as we feel into the heavens, feel into the earth, expand out into galaxies, expand out into space, anything we feel called to connect with. We are witnessing, we are embodying love embodying our self, our higher self, our being, our presence. This particular tuning fork I'm going to be working with is a um, Bulio. John Bulio is a sound healer. And the intention of this particular tuning fork is DNA, a reboot of the DNA. May this support your nervous system. May this support your spiritual practice. May this support your energetic field. Anything. clarify, inspire, empower, solidify, and balance.
Take a deep breath. Inhale. Allow this breath to extend to every cell in your body. Anchor into this beautiful body. Ground into this beautiful body. We have the opportunity, the experience right now to embody spirit in human form. Savor this. Experience this. Enjoy this. What an opportunity. What an opportunity. I bask in your light. I bask in your love. Thank you for those who have written me little messages. I see them. Thank you for your feedback. Another deep breath. communicating, connecting. What if you knew you allowed in, you were doing this without even trying, simply by being? You are doing this and more. And we thank you. We thank you for your service. We thank you for your attention. Your body thanks you for your presence, for your honor. You are so loved. All is well. <laughs> oh, and that's my cat Alfie. He says hello. <laughs> Joy. Joy just came in. How about that? Oh, so good to see all of you. Thank you for joining. If you haven't been on the live stream, I will pin this to the top of my Facebook page, Soul Song Quest, so that you may listen to again if you should feel called, or if you want to listen to the first time. All that is coming through was led by who is here. I thank you all for the co-creation, for the honor. So good to see you. So go good <laughs> to feel you. And so sacred. Sacred to connect with you. May my open heart meet yours. May we support each other love each other. I will be doing this weekly at this time. Please join me again or watch this live. Please share any feedback you have with comments so that I may improve if need be or simply connect with you. Thank you. Thank you.